Let's see how we can change margins in Word 2019. This is a paper that I had written a while back. So what we're going to do is go to Layout at the top, and then you can see the Margin button. So we see by default it's set to Normal. However, we can change that to Narrow. Now watch what happens on this ruler that we see here when we change this to Narrow. There we go. It's split out on both sides evenly. We can change it to other ones as well. There's Moderate wide, mirrored, and we have the old Office 2003 default, which doesn't look that much different. We'll go back to normal. All right, so that's all the presets. Now let's customize it. We'll click on Custom Margins, and we can see here margins are set for the top, the left, the bottom, the right, and we don't have to have them equal if we don't want to. So for instance, I could make the top margin anything I want. I can type it in as well. I don't have to uh, just hit the up or down arrow. And I can make the left margin a little bit less if I want. We also see this option for the gutter, and that has to do if you're going to be binding this in a notebook or in a, a, a bindable book. You'll want to have a gutter position uh, which is greater than zero, otherwise you might be cutting off some of your text. But we're not doing that. We're just using top, left, bottom, and right. We can also change our orientation from portrait to landscape, and we see a little preview at the bottom of how that looks. Now we can apply this to the entire document or from this point forward. So we don't have to do the entire document this way if we don't want to. We can also set this as the default. So whatever changes we made, we set it as default. The next time we open up Word, then it will be set the exact same way. And that could certainly help you if you write the same types of papers over and over. So that's how we do custom margins as well as presets in Microsoft Word 2019.